Hey everyone, how's it going? Uh, today we are uh, out by the waterfront here in Lake Erie, uh, Crystal Beach to be precise, and we're going to try and do a weather vlog. So if you're watching this, that means uh, something happened and we might get a video out and put it on YouTube. Anyways, quite a few alerts out today for water spouts. Uh, today is uh, Sunday the 1st of August uh, 2021. Uh, there's already been five sightings of funnel clouds and a water spout further down Lake Erie this morning, confirmed sightings. And we're at the east end of Lake Erie. And uh, here with my friend Rick, uh, we're both storm spotters. We're keeping an eye out on the waters. We're just in a gap in the rain right now, so it's just starting to clear. Uh, as soon as we get a gap in the weather, we're going to head out towards uh, Point Abino and maybe set up a little camp out there, which gives us a great advantage point over the lake, looking uh, east and west and also directly south. So uh, fingers crossed. So today is going to be uh, a storm chasing video. Enjoy. Uh, the marine radio is notifying us uh, a water spout has been spotted uh, 50 miles off from Dunkirk which is if I'm not mistaken is, is on the US side just way down there so we may get some action Now we play the waiting game. Uh, just came over on the marine radio that there is a reliable source saying a uh, water spout has been spotted just off Dunkirk. Uh, she's across the river, across the lake that side. So uh, we, are, we are hoping we may get some action. These clouds are starting to take a nice formation, uh, which are coming off uh, to the Canadian side and making their way over the uh, lake. So keep our eyes open. It's definitely a waiting game. So no storms came while we're uh, at the lighthouse. So we went back to Crystal Beach. And we had to wait an hour. Uh, but this has now appeared on radar. There is a few weather warnings out for our region. And we got that coming in. So that should be with us probably in about 30 minutes time. Uh, there's a lot of lightning detected in that. Uh, just approaching the Niagara region. So we'll see what we get here. There's also, uh, they're still saying there's a uh, water spout activity probably going to be connected to this, the, uh, the back end of it. So that's what we're going to hopefully try and capture. Otherwise, today's just been a dud. Just keeping an eye on these clouds behind us and uh, looks like there's one trying to appear, a little funnel cloud just over there. It's trying to take shape. Looks like it's disappearing again now, but I can still see the line on it going at an angle, 45 degrees. But uh, we are under a water spout watch right now. We still might get a result today. All right, just uh where the light is just slight way above my finger there's one appearing up oh, there's a water spout right there it's now starting to form we just need to drop down a bit more then we should get a nice look at that so we, there's the first one it's a little skinny but he's trying it's nice and skinny It paid off. We got a water spout. We actually got a water spout yeah. right there. We went right out of the clouds, right down, dropping down. It's on the water. It's, yeah, it's just about to touch. Look, it's on the water now. It's so skinny. It's a really skinny spout. You can just about work him out, but he's so skinny. All right, so there we have it. The uh, first water spout I've seen this season is a good one, very skinny, um, but it, we watched it form and we actually managed to track it all the way down to the water. Now there's a bit of lightning over there. I just missed that. Uh, we've got a huge system coming in here. Um, so we might get an active uh, half hour here. Way down there, big droppage of scud. So we'll keep an eye on that one as well. 
nice cloud line all the way around. But the uh, water spout is now gone, and we'll just keep monitoring the skies. A broken line of showers and thunderstorms producing water spouts were located. Okay, we got another one just forming. See where the rain cloud is? It's just there, right there. It's just starting to form now, it's starting to dip down. Let's wait for that to come a bit lower. Look at this. So you can see the tip of it coming down. Uh, you can see it arcing up. This one's, this one's now thicker than the other one. And you can see the water being kicked around. So hopefully when I go home and edit this, I can actually zoom in a little bit better because it doesn't do it justice on the camera. But that's cool. So two water spouts in 10 minutes. We just want one to be a lot closer to us. Bonus, we now have another one just forming right here. Just starting to come down. Another skinny one, so that's the third one. All right, the uh, the big one's arcing. And there's a little ditty one now, look at this, it's starting to come down, it's getting closer to the water. It's halfway down to the water now. It's very skinny. So it's probably not picking it up very well, but it's uh, definitely getting closer. And we've, oh, yep, yeah, yeah, it's taking form over there. I see it now. Yep. Yeah, by the lighthouse. Just to the left of the lighthouse is one just forming now. This water spout, it's just, it's just hovering. This one hasn't touched the ground just yet. This one just here. That one is still dancing. Look at that. That turned out to be a good one. Now there was one forming over here, but we just lost it in the rain cloud completely. All right, so the, uh, the water spout right behind us is now been going for about 15 minutes. Uh, the one that didn't touch the water is kind of starting to disintegrate a little bit. And the first one only lasted about six or seven minutes, but that one's now been going for 15 minutes and it's still going pretty strong. But uh, still very, very active over here. There's a lot of like drops coming down. Yeah, we think there could be another possible one over here very, very shortly. I caught that one. Right, there you have it it ended up being a success in the end we managed to get four spouts out of that uh three confirmed touched the ground and one just stayed slightly above um hopefully it showed up pretty good on the video so anyway uh thanks very much for watching hope you enjoyed it please make sure you like and subscribe and uh i'll just keep pumping out the content as often as i can as soon as i see active weather i'll get out there as quick as i can and get it for you all right until next time see you all very soon